Hi everybody. So I'm just doing a quick video today um, because I really want to change this tongue ring out of my mouth. Um, as you can see, there is quite a bit of extra bar. So I feel like, oh my god, there are so many animals just falling by my camera right now. Um, I feel like it's time to downsize a little bit more. It has already been downsized once by my piercer. It is over four weeks old now, so I feel like it should be pretty good to change. I'm going to use this ring and like try to use it to thread my new one through. I'm a little bit uncomfortable with it. Everything is autoclaved, so everything is hygienic. I've already mouthwashed my mouth. Um, and I have rubber gloves to help with this process. First, I'm going to open this. I'm just going to go slow. I don't want to lose any of my balls. That would suck. Let me get my new rod. Let's see. I think it's going to be significantly shorter. And one of my little balls. Now, I'm going to try to replicate this as closely to how my piercer did it as possible. So now I have, oh, I washed my hands, of course. So now I have one ball on the bar. And now is the part that scares me. I want to have my next ball ready. And now the part that scares me. This is gonna be super attractive, guys. Like, super duper attractive. Loves. Thank you to all of the YouTubers <laughs> that told me to use gloves. I had no idea how I was gonna get these balls off. Okay, I have really good grip on these balls and this is still really difficult. Okay. Oh my god. Uh, hey.
Oh my god, I feel so much better. And as you can see, there's still a little bit of bar left, so it's not too small for my tongue. Mm. I even want to make it as fat as I can. It's not digging in anywhere. I do have one size smaller that I am going to consider trying, but for now, this is the size I was comfortable going to because there's one size down from the bar I had in. That was 16 um, millimeter. I believe that this is 14 millimeter. Eh. Uh, I couldn't really find any 15 millimeter. I don't know if that's normal. Um, and I think I also have a 13 millimeter in here. So if this ends up feeling big for any reason, I'm gonna switch down. Um, I kind of just want to see what is most comfortable for my tongue. But this already feels so much better. I don't feel like clanking. I don't personally like long barbells. I bit that one a couple times. Thankfully, my teeth feel fine. But clearly, that is like risky. So, for now, I'm very grateful. And yeah, like, I think it looks great. Um, this is not a high end barbell. I'm doing this for sizing reasons. Um, I'm planning on getting a nice, pretty, anatomical barbell once I know what size I personally prefer the most, whether it is, I, well, I know millimeters, so this is 14 or 13. I know 13 is, I think, half an inch, and then, is 9 12th of an inch? 14? I'm not sure. But whatever. Um, once I know what my personal preference is, either 13 millimeters or 14 millimeters, I'm definitely going to get a titanium barbell for my tongue because I don't want to end up with a um, nickel allergy from steel. Um, it's also just a really good like metal to have long term. And once I know what size I want, I'm probably not going to switch this out a lot. I kind of I'm super low maintenance with my body jewelry, as you can tell from the septum ring that I've never changed. Uh, I was planning on changing it today, but we'll see if that happens. If I'm wearing the same outfit and makeup in my septum changing video, you'll know that I did it the same day, or maybe I'll do it tomorrow or on Monday. We'll see. But anyway, I hope that this was at all helpful. I know a lot of people are really scared of changing their tongue bar for the first time, and I was too. And that was actually really, really easy, except for trying to get the ball on. I was so scared of, like, threading it through my tongue. The bar, the ball was the most difficult. Um, it also freaked me out because I was hoping to take the top ball off, and clearly that's not how that ended up working, but yeah, getting it through, especially using, like, the other bar, that was super easy. Yeah. So, if you have any questions or anything about changing your tongue bar, um, clearly I'm not an expert, but I just did it and it wasn't that difficult, so feel free to leave them down below. Um, if you have any piercing related videos that you would like to see, I clearly don't have that many. Like I have my helix, double lobes, septum, tongue. Um, but I'm interested in a lot more, so feel free to leave those down below. Um, Give this a thumbs up if it was helpful at all, or if you just enjoyed it, and I'll see you again soon. Thanks! Bye!